your real friends, the people who are true to you and want to see you succeed, are going to say, listen, I know this is what you want to do. I'm going to help you think about it, plan it out, but we're going to do it and we're going to do it the smart way. So uh, this is the way CAS works. We're going to do our normal warm-up that's going to be the easiest part of class. Then we're going to do five different interval rounds. So we're going to do uh, like three exercises for two minutes and then for 90 seconds. So some are going to be burpees and some squat jumps, some things you maybe never saw before. After that and you're exhausted and can't walk, then we're going to make teams and we're going to do some cool team competitions. As always, you can take breaks, no one's going to judge you, uh, get some water, you know, rest out around, no big deal. Uh, still a judgment-free zone. Um, but we're going to lock the door so you can't escape. I'm just kidding. Uh, but if you need anything like water, Gatorade, let us know and we'll start in like two minutes, okay? So, tonight's all about standing your ground, being strong in who you are and your decisions. I'm super fired up about this one because this one, as Jason was making fun of me earlier, Jason's realized the trend. Everything I talk about in emoji mode is something I'm going through like right now. So you know I'm not gonna BS you guys. I'm never gonna talk about being, I'm 100% at peace with my life and everything's great because I know that's not realistic. Understand, 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 understand. Four, three, two, and done. Anyway, uh, so welcome to chaos, long awaited. Uh, proud of you guys because so many people sign up for chaos and then don't show up. It's like the weirdest thing or they cancel last minute. So the fact that you guys committed six weeks ago and actually showed up, very, very proud of you. Uh, our next big event is going to be on the 20th. That's our form focus workshop where we're going to focus on stretches, how to do planks correctly, squats correctly, lunges correctly, kicks correctly. If you've never done form focus, I highly recommend it. Who in their right mind thinks they have the right to tell you that you shouldn't be doing what you're doing? Granted, if it's hazardous to your health, if you're doing drugs, or you're getting drunk every day of the week, then people should probably step in. So this is not what this is about. This is about when you're making those steps to reach your goal. When you're making changes in your life to become better, to become stronger. Because there are gonna be toxic people that see you becoming better and reaching your goals and going, mm, no, I'm gonna grab you, pull you back, and make you miserable just like I am. And that's not a person you need. That person's not going to help you grow and become stronger and become better. So plank, squat, power jump. Now, if power jump's a little bit too tough, you can do regular squat jumps or regular squats like that. That's fine. As long as we're squatting, right? Second, we're going to do uh, lunge pulses. We're going to do five of them and then jump, five of them. Jump, five of them. Got it? Then we're going to do squat jack. So hands start at the top, so now people get confused. You're going to go down as you squat. Squat, touch the outside of your ankle, back up, feet together. So like jumping jacks, both a squat. But your real friends, the people who are true to you and want to see you succeed, are going to say, listen, I know this is what you want to do. I'm going to help you think about it, plan it out, but we're going to do it and we're going to do it the smart way. Every single person in your team is going to do a series of exercises. They're going to do 10 jumping jacks, 10 high knees, 10 burpees, and 10 x-ups. So what happens is, listen, 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 I'm going to say it again. So Nicole goes first. She does 10 jumping jacks, 10 high knees, 10 burpees, 10 x-ups, and then Cheryl goes. She does 10, 10, 10, 10. So tonight, guys, I want you to stand tall, stand your ground, and tell people, this is my life. I'm going to live it the way I see fit. And if you don't like it, tough shit. If you agree with that, if you're gonna start standing true and standing tall and standing your ground, hit that heart button right now. All right guys, so um, one, be very, very proud of yourselves. That was a hard workout. It's definitely hard to clap it up, clap it up for yourself. So, um, it's cool, so I always say consistency over time uh, allows you to do really intense things later on, right? So a lot of people start off like a workout or nutrition like super intense and they go too hard too fast and then they burn out, right? But you guys are all very consistent. You take class regularly as much as possible and when you do it consistently then you can challenge yourself once in a while. Should you do this every day? No. <laughs> but once in a while it's good to challenge yourself. 
Whenever you get to that point of like, you cannot go anymore and you go a little bit more, you're literally reprogramming your mind and your body to get to the next level. I like, I tell the girls, I, I like, uh, when we do team competitions, like everyone is supporting each other and like cheering each other on, which is really cool because unfortunately, most of the time you don't see women really lifting each other up. You see them chopping each other down and uh, we really focus on the opposite of that here, which is kind of cool. So. I love chaos. Um, I'm also very energetic at 11 p.m. for some weird reason. So uh, I like uh, I like these late night classes. So that's it. Peace out, guys. Bye.